Hi everyone, I uh, just want to make a video to show you how to use the rotate function in AutoCAD. Um, I have received a question to, that asked me to rotate one line parallel to another line. So I'm just going to use that as an example to show you how to use the function. So as you can see I have a line here, it's a random line, it doesn't have a specific degree or anything. So I'm going to draw a new line. So I'm going to type in L and then enter to go into the line function. I'm just going to type in uh, or draw a random, not a random line, I'm going to draw this one polar to the z uh, x axis. So to rotate this one so that it's parallel to the line above, there's a few ways of doing it. I'm just going to show you one or two ways. So you can select the top one and make a copy of that so by C O enter and then copy it from this endpoint to that endpoint. And then I'm going to select the line I want to rotate and go into the rotate function you can either go into the rotate function in the modify tab up here or you can type in r for rotate so i'm going to click on that rotate function i'm going to click a starting point or fixed point for the object so as you can see it's already selected the line um, as what can i say like a base for for the rotation so i'm just going to rotate it the other way for now just to show you what happens if you rotate it without if you rotate it without uh, the line sticking to the, the object you want to rotate so if you want to get that line to stick to the object you want to rotate you can type in R to go to reference enter so I can select the start and end point of the line and as you can see now I'm using that line as a reference so then you can rotate it up so it's parallel to the other one and you can delete the first one you copied there so then you have two lines that are parallel to each other so you can rotate um, to a specific degree as well so I'm just going to start with typing or creating a new line so there's my new line I'm going to select this one I'm going to into the rotate function I'm going to click a base from where it should rotate and as you can see it's already using the line as sort of a reference for my rotation so I can maybe I want to rotate it 90 degrees so I can just type in 90 for 90 degrees and as you can see it rotated the line 90 degrees you can type in any degrees you want and it will rotate from that base point that you selected I hope this clears this up for you. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.